Hey everybody, welcome back to more DVD unboxing videos and this will be the last iconic moments unboxing video you're going to see from me for a while because I cannot find any new ones and this last title coming in number 83 is from E1 Entertainment 12 Years a Slave I have not seen this film so I can't really comment on the film itself but I'm going to go over the slip cover in the back and then go with a brief description and see what's inside the disc so let's have a look at the front and as we can already tell it has a lot of information especially at this time they put all the actors the main actors on the middle down coming downwards on the slip cover you don't really normally see that we normally see them either at the top going across but we never actually see them coming down before that is a really nice touch the quotation here is i don't want to survive i want to live giving it an eight uh giving it a 15 age rating it was two for 10 pounds but you can pay 5.99 if you want i believe this one i had to pay 5.99 because i couldn't get it with another dvd I tried looking for another DVD to buy to save myself a bit of money, but I thought, you know what, there's nothing that catches my eye, so I thought I'd just buy this and end the day off. Then we have the spine, which, you know, has the E1 Entertainment, which is the first one we've done in ages, with the 83 uh, numbering right there. Then we have the 12 Years a Slave title right down there. Bit of open space, they could have done more if they wanted to. Then on to the back, which we are just going to pause and zoom in. And from the top it says Entertainment One invites you. I always say E1 Entertainment because of the short aberration for it, but it's actually called Entertainment, that's the E. But I call it E1 Entertainment. Uh, invites you to celebrate the most iconic moments in film history, labeling at number 83. Then we have the bar description, which is basically from the acclaimed director Steve McQueen comes the incredible true story of one man's fight for survival and freedom. It is 1841 and Simonon uh, Northup, which I hope I pronounced the name right, if not I do apologise, a free black man from an upstate New York is obstructed and sold into slavery. Stripped of his identity and deprived of all dignity, Northup is purchased by ruthless plantation owner Edwin Epps, which I hope they have pronounced that name right, and must find the strength to survive within. In its 12th year in captivity, a chance to meet a Canadian forever alters his life. Filled with powerful performance by an outstanding cast, 12 Years a Slave is both an upflitching account of slavery and a celebration of the power of hope. Bonus features include the team meet with the creative minds, assembled by director Steve McQueen to bring in Simone Northup's journey to life. Then we have images on the left, Right, so now we've gone through that, let's slide it open. And already, I pretty much prefer this cover than this one. Because we have him, like, sprinting, but then we also have the title here, like, 12 Years a Slave, which is more better than how this one's like. Because this is, like, bright yellow coming out like a sun. Then we have, like, a scroll where he's just writing letters or memoirs. This really speaks more than that. Maybe because of the pens, might and the sword. I think that's what they're trying to go with with that. Then we have by Metro, Unmissable Film of the Year, giving it a five star rating. We also have the extraordinary true story of Solomon uh, Northup. And then at the top, we have Oscar winning Best Picture, Supporting Actress, Adapted Screenplay. And then the BAFTA winner of Best Film, Leading Actor. And then even the spines are so similar in some ways. And on to the back, we just have a bit very different on how it's more approached so we have the bar description here we also have another quotation from shortlist one of the finest films ever made then we have the guardian daily telegraph and the times all giving it a five star with the daily mail quoting it everyone should see this film which i'm definitely going to watch this after the unboxing video because i'm very intrigued to watch it from start to finish and i also want to take a look at the special features as well then we have images down below, which is more than what we get on the slip cover one. So anyway, let's go back into this one. Breaking it down aside. The there we go. And then let's open this up. And then we have the disc art, which is basically the same cover from the front, but at least they included the title. So it makes it more plush and com like you know straightforward. Even then, the background on the disc art is white as well with a white case. But yeah, that's the unboxing video of 12 Years of Slave. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe to post notifications by ticking that bell icon. And I'll see you in the next awesome unboxing video. But until then, take care.